uh, take it out for a spin. Uh, it's Markdown based. It's really cool, uh, really fast, easy to maintain a website. Um, yeah, if you're a freelancer, you're just going to love Grav because how easy it is to use. So uh, stick around to the end of the video to see what all Grav can do for you. Uh, see you next time and please don't forget to like and subscribe. Thank you. What's up everybody? Welcome to my channel. My name is Prasanna Kulkarni and today I'm going to talk to you about Grab. So if you are uh, familiar with WordPress or Drupal and if you're wondering what Grab is all about or uh, if you, uh, you know, then this video is just for you. We are going to go through what Grab is and how it is different from WordPress. I want you to take uh, only one thing uh, from this video if uh, you know, if, if that was uh, imposed somehow, that Grab doesn't have a database, right? It's a flat file CMS. It's a file system. So think about it as like your content being marked down files, uh, which are just like text files, but with additional features. Uh, they're just marked down files like on your computer inside a folder. And uh, that's basically, you can turn that into website. So you don't have to worry about logging into website. You can just uh, edit some text, press save, and your content on your website is updated. I think that's really powerful and it opens up a lot of workflows for content creators, for bloggers, uh, for <clears throat> educators, right? For So it's, it's really powerful. So let's take a look at Grab. I'm really excited and can't wait to show you all. So first off, let me demo it for you. So this is VS Code uh, editor on my local machine, right? And uh, I have a text file. So this is all it is. It's just like uh, a text file, but instead of .txt, it's .md at the end. That's what it is. And it is inside this folder over here. You can use any other editor if you want. There are a lot of great editors, uh, Sublime Text, or a lot of uh, uh, Markdown specific editors also. I'm using Visual Studio Code. So I'm going to change this text. Um, say this will, whatever, show up on the website. And press Save. And using SFTP, this folder is synced with my cPanel, so you can see on my website, I, I see this text over here. So it's on my website. I go back, I add 333, save this, uh, refresh, <clears throat> and I see this text. Because this is being synced using WinSCP over here, you can see. Uh, as I'm saving files, it is syncing with my cPanel. If you're familiar with cPanel, this is uh, this might sound really interesting. So, what is Grab? Let's go and check out Grab. I'm really excited about that. So, this is Grab website. Uh, it's an open source CMS content management system. I think it really helps you manage your content, do more with your content. You know, not uh, content is easy, so you can just store it in folders on your website, I think, and Grabs uh, makes it possible. All right, so let's take a look at, uh, yeah, it has won a lot of awards. It is fast, extensible, and open source. Very easy to use, yes, I can attest to that. If you think WordPress is easy to use, Grav is uh, more easy to use, I would say, because it doesn't have database, right? I think that's a big uh, hurdle for newcomers to like know what a database is. They can wrap uh, their head around a folder and a file inside, inside that folder, like images inside a folder that's like a contained blog. You know, they can wrap their head around that. These are some screenshots of the admin panel. <coughs> yeah, 
Oh, Andy. Yeah, if you're familiar with uh, the Joomla community, you know you would be familiar with Andy. He's uh, the founder of uh, the Graph Project. Yeah, really cool admin plugin. Be a hero developer. If you're a developer, you're going to love Graph because you can spin up websites really, really fast. Enjoyable content creation, I can attest. Stellar performance, it has caching, it, it optimizes your images, it has multi-language support, dynamic content types, backups, easy thing customization. It's based on Symfony and <clears throat> uh, Twig. It's by it's made by you know uh, Trilby, the good people at Trilby Media. Thank you so much for them for all of the uh, amazing plugins that makes Grab so much enjoyable to use. It's community driven. So if you're on Discord, like check out the Discord channel. It's really active. If you get stuck uh, in Grab, you should you know uh, ask your question in Discord. You can support Grab. Uh, I I do yearly uh, on Open Collective. Yeah, there are basically no limits because it uses the best in PHP uh, ecosystem, and uh, so you don't have to worry about integrity, right? And there, these are some uh, good things about Grab. Uh, you can tell I, I just love Grab. So I came in uh, contact with Grab. Uh, when I was working with Motic, which is an open source project, and their documentation at that point was on Crab. Um, and that's how I got started with Crab. So I talked about Crab in SCP, how I came in contact, uh, Flat File CMS. Yeah, and it, you know, it's going to, it's very easy to install uh, if you're using cPanel for your WordPress. Uh, there are the, you can go to Grab Developer website, which I think is uh, Grab Learn. <clears throat> On this website, you can check like how you can install Grab. It's a trivial process, yeah. You can really easily install Grab. If you have Composer on your uh, cPanel, I think that's the easiest way. If not, you can unzip a zip file on your server in cPanel uh, under the root directory, and uh, it should just work if you go to that URL. You can test it on, out on your local also. I would highly encourage that. Okay, so uh, one might ask how much you can push this folder-based website. I think you can push it a lot. On a HostGator baby plan, I'm, uh, I have a website which has about 10,000 folders as blocks. So each folder has a text file, uh, a markdown file, sorry. And uh, so there are basically uh, 10,000 blogs with pagination and all of the features of blogs. So I'm really excited to show uh, show that uh, to you. So let's go check it out. So here is uh, a Python, you know, there's a Python script that I wrote to basically create, uh, based on some criteria, 10,000 folders on my local machine, which you can see over here, 10,000 folders. You know, I didn't make them, the script made it for me. Um, and yeah, so it's like, uh, basically, uh, each blog uh, doesn't have a lot of content in it, just like the title of the blog uh, uh, and a little bit content. And uh, I put it all on uh, my uh, uh, project website that I'm working, iterator.com. So you can see all of those uh, folders are basically these blogs, right? You can click on the blog and uh, it's going to open up that blog. As I said, I don't have much content on it right now. It has all the pagination and stuff. Let's go check out uh, how Grab is. So, uh, OK, 
Okay, so that was a brief introduction about Grab. It's really easy to use. You should install it on your local machine and give it a test, you know, take it out for a test drive. Or you can install it on your whatever hosting provider you are using uh, on a domain that you just have standing. Uh, take it out for a spin. Uh, it's Markdown based. It's really cool, uh, really fast, easy to maintain a website. Um, yeah, if you're a freelancer, you're just going to love Grab because how easy it is to use. Uh, see you next time and please don't forget to like and subscribe. Thank you.